February of 2017, Mike McLaughlin, chairman of the board of ITEM, and I traveled to Africa for the first time to teach in Kenya and to explore whether or not Kenya might be a good fit for ITEM to serve in. While we were there, I picked up an interesting little souvenir. It's in the shape of Africa, and when you remove Kenya, the top slides away to produce a little knickknack box. The salesman told me that this was to remind people that Kenya is actually the key to all of Africa. And the more I think about it, I think he may be right. Consider these facts about Kenya. This morning I'm meeting with Daniel Mwende, who is director of the All Nations College here in Kenya, and he's going to tell us a little bit about the ministry there. One of the things that I would want even to note, you to note is Kenya is an open ground for ministry and missions. I can compare Kenya with the parable of the sower, where Jesus talked about the many soils, and one of the soils is the fertile soil that you know, the seed were planted and were able to grow in 30, 60, and 100. And therefore, Kenya, today, where we are, all nations, is that part of the soil where we find ministers from all regions have been able to be trained and be able to uh, reach their regions. One of the greatest challenges that we've been having in training these men is because some of them are coming from contradicting cultures that those cultures are... Are, are, are not, you know, respecting the authority of the scripture. And it is our responsibility during our training, we find that we need to help them overcome those adults in order that they may, may, may embrace what we call reformed theology, whereby they can be able to stand on the basic cardinal principles of scripture. We needed to train men to be able to understand what is good news, what is the truth, and how they can impart the world, the Kenyan people, with the gospel message. And it is through the establishment of All Nations College Kenya campus, which was born in 2007. And between then until to date, we've been able to graduate over 300 pastors who are from all denominations. And because there's been in Kenya a lot of what we call prosperity gospel, there's been a lot of cultic movement, there's been whereby people have been mixing gospel with, you know, error. And it's during that time we felt that we needed to set up an institution for all ministers from all denominations, from all walks of life, that they can be trained in a particular common center to be trained with the truth of the word and get the skills and the competences that they require for ministry. Uh, last year, Kenyan government, through the Ministry of uh, Prisons, they engaged their prison chaplains to be taught at All Nations College Camp, Kenya campus and we were able to train 40 chaplains who are working within prison, men prisons and women prisons in Kenya. Now, while there are colleges and seminaries all over Africa, most pastors and national Christian leaders don't really have the time or the money to be able to travel and leave their communities, their churches, and their families behind in order to get the training which may last for semesters or years at a time. Item wants to help by bringing the training to the pastors. 